Kevin Samuels, and I know Sean had hate that guy. Oh, uh, Lord. But, <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, he often, he'll say, well, high value men who make over a certain amount, they're not chasing nobody at all. They're mm. not shooting a shot. Mm. What's your take on that? Because they don't have to, right? <laughs> I've worked around a lot of high value men and I do not care to have one. Um, there mm, is a lot that, that comes that with ego that, that comes with that. Yeah. There's a mm. lot that comes with that. And so um, yeah, like that what? makes sense. Like what? Because it's a power, it's power, it's money. Yeah. It, it all goes into that. Control. It's, control. it's not controlling. Yeah, it's control yeah they're controlling. The the mm -mm. It's a control they thing. Think it's and anything, some women are okay with that. Yeah, some women I don't think it's a control women. thing. It's just the status, because it's just like the same with a female. I couldn't, just me, I couldn't date a female that had thousands of dudes in her DM. It's not the trust factor, it's just the factor of, one, why you responded, and then two, you know, that's the lifestyle that's got to come with, so you got to be prepared for that. So I feel like the same thing with high-value men, a lot of ladies got to be, you know, got to understand that, hey, he's going to have shorties approaching him left and right. You got to be comfortable. And I agree with that. I mean, I do agree with that. I understand that a high value man doesn't have to go chase because they have money. There's a, a whole mindset that comes with that. It's a level of confidence. It's a level yeah. of, um, you know, this is my shit. You take it or leave it. You know what I mean? And most high value men do have a sense of a power seeking controlliness about them and not in a bad sense. When I say controlling, I'm not meaning like you can't do this, you can't do that. But most of them are powerful. They own their own business. They're entrepreneurs. They right. have power. And so that trans, you know, that translates into their relationships as well. And they tend yeah. to want their women to look a certain way, act a certain way, do certain <coughs> things. <laughs> oh, oh, T.O. Oh, 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 that is him all the way. That is T. Here we go. Oh, go ahead. Yes, Keep on going, dude. I like it. That is him all the way. Yeah, you know, dude, I like I it. I, I understand the connection with that. I'm not, that is just the, that's the nature of The me. nature of it. But you don't right. have to choose that. Every woman don't want a high value man. Right. I choose not to want to live like that. So you want to settle with a guy that's making $35,000 and he's broken, he could barely pay his bills? No, 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 Right. Huh? I feel like there's a medium. There, it don't have to be, you got to have a millionaire or you got to have a broke ass. Like we got right, exactly. to be so, there, exactly. Right? that are still living comfortable, good lives that are fulfilled, that are happy, that are taking vacations, that have assets. There's a medium. So that's what I'm looking for. I don't need the millionaire because I understand that there are things that come along with that lifestyle that I personally do not want to deal with. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So, and that's a choice. That's a choice for yeah. everybody. And so it's nothing wrong for a high value man to want that from their woman, but it's nothing wrong for a woman to be like, yo, I don't want to deal with that shit either. Yeah. I don't want right. you to Kevin said women sometimes they think, oh, well, I have to make $100,000, but men don't really look for women to make $100,000. You know, we just look to see that your body look good, you're pretty, you have a nice, I don't know, hairdo, nails, your shit is together, you can dress. That's what we look for. We don't look mm -hmm. to be like, oh shit, on paper, you make a hundred thousand dollars. And that's where we go down, a, that's where we sometimes go wrong too, because we end up lusting and not really finding the person. Mm -hmm. that, that, not that, loving, that okay. Because, right. okay. I mean, okay. Real, you don't look really at need it. her to make a hundred thousand though. You know what I mean? As a guy, you don't, like, you don't need her to, but you also, you know, the way he said it, because I heard when he said that, he said it in the fact of like, we only look for, you know, a chick to look good. But if I get with a chick and she bomb and she look good, but she dumb as rocks, we not going, we not mm -hmm. going to make it. We exactly. have no intellectual. Exactly. She got a, so it's, nest, a it's stink more that right. goes into it. So the way he said it was almost like me as men only look for hot girls. And I'm like, that's mm -hmm. not necessarily the case. Because right, right, it's, right. It's chicks out there that you get with them, you're like, wait, I see why your ass is saying. Yeah, like I agree. Look, I watched enough of his videos and I totally agree with probably like 85, 90% of what he says up there. I don't know about y'all, but. So what's the I feel like, certain no, type no, of people? No, no. Huh? Yeah, I feel like he does speak he to for certain a certain type of, type of situation, right? Yeah. So mm -hmm. going back to the high value man, he's speaking truth, but that mm -hmm. don't mean every woman needs to want to deal with that now, but just realize right. that when you deal with a high value man, this is what comes along with that, right? Mm -hmm. So yeah. it's also, mm -hmm. Well, yeah, a high value man, but then also just men in general, though, right? Because if mm. women don't have certain things together, whether like, so he focused mainly on women that got kids, 
Um, and then like, oh, well, have you been married to the baby daddy and stuff like that? And then she's like, no. And then he fully attacks that. He's like, all right, so why did you have a kid with that person then? You know, so and when people hear that shit, they don't like it. But it is the truth. All right. Uh, last question. Now, do you want a high value man? I don't need to, to be honest with you. But if I do have a high value man, I just want to make sure that if whatever expectations he has of me, you know, we have to kind of coincide and have the same expectations of each other. Like he's a high value man. I would be a high value woman. You know, I don't want him to think because he has a certain status and, you know, I'm okay and I'm surviving. I can make ends meet that, that I have to kind of conform to like, what he wants of me i need to have some control in the relationship too so, until that happens i'll let you know so okay <laughs> so before we close and this is for everybody well for the three ladies um do you guys <laughs> oh, <Lord. laughs> oh, man. okay so do you agree with him when he says shit like women are the uh no men are the consumers and females are the producers type of thing I don't I don't really uh that I'll just say no, I don't agree with, with that statement that he makes. Okay. Brett. I do like Kevin Samuels. I feel like, you know, I can I enjoy what he listening to just because I do feel like a lot of things that he says is true. Um on a yeah. big it's not a one shoe, you know, one size shoe fits all situation. Like you said, like uh Daniel said, it's it doesn't and things that he say doesn't you know pertain to every single person so His check this out like it's facts there's a video that he said a lot of women ask that question who are you and he was like those are the broke trauma type of females that he's talking about <laughs> when they say it that is. who are you that's what he's talking broke, about so and i have no oh, trauma yeah, he so he's it. wrong yeah. right there <laughs> you just because say that because that's the question that Come against you. You know what? Yeah, but yeah. Yeah. So when people, but when people are, say, "Who are you?" It's because they don't like. They don't like what they hear. So they're like, "Who no, are you so to say that?" Answer for you not to be able to answer the question, but to say, "Oh, you only ask that because you broke in trauma." Like, right. No, that's, that's, ignorant. that's him that's ignorant. being that's a manipulative and trying to. Yeah. yeah. Like, yeah. Like, that's no, those when, times. when they say when you've been attacking people and mm -hmm. they say, "Yo, run your credentials," he and then, "Oh, you only ask that because you want these broke chicks." No, he I'm can dish it, but can't take it. Yeah, take it. Woo. You can't do that. You can't do mm -hmm. that. So I'm like, nah, miss me with that.